Hey, babe. What you doing? I am uh, stringing up my fishing poles. Just getting ready for the season? You gotta have that right line. Your knot's tied right, you know what I'm saying? You excited to uh, go catch some mondos this season? Oh yeah, you know I'm always ready to catch a mondo. This is, this is gonna be my year to catch a mondo, I believe. Big mondo. So, what would you think if I got an eight pounder? Or um, a nine pounder? Maybe a 10 pounder? <laughs> Double digit? Oh yeah, that's a true mondo, babe. I'm thinking this is my year. I like your attitude here, but uh, why are you so sure you're gonna be catching a big one this year? Or why is this the year? Well, it's because I got a baby growing in me. We're gonna be parents. Wow, I thought we'd get another dog first. You better put on your best game face right here, dude. Well, babe, that's that's awesome. I mean, how long have you known? I don't know. I, I, I just found out. Like, I went to the bathroom in the house, and now I'm telling you, and it's just all happening so fast. Do you know what it's due? I guess, what would that be? Nine months, uh, mid-September? Oh, no. That's only the beginning of hunting season. Prime fishing, too. However, I will have a hunting and fishing buddy later on. A couple years from then, that's going to be pretty cool, man. Oh, I'm so excited. What if I have a little girl? She could be like a little mini-me, yeah. Or a little boy. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, babe. Oh, we're gonna have a little fishing freak. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be crazy. I'm so excited you decided to tell me my brand new bass boat. I can't think of a better spot. Oh my gosh. y'all we are with child <laughs> Woo! Hee -hee. we're having a baby that's right Cheers. this is not alcohol no yeah. it's, it's coffee <laughs> it's my sad little small cup of coffee that's right because you can't be drinking much caffeine it sucks when you're at the free range house so i'm just <laughs> drinking it all the time it's okay i savor my cup of coffee in the in the middle of the day when i feel really tired well tell everyone how far along all right, so we are officially eight weeks now. Yep, eight weeks. Um, due date is in September. That is right, you guys heard right. Yeah. Beginning of hunting season. Yeah. So I'm sorry. <laughs> so obviously, I wasn't. I wasn't disappointed. The, the <laughs> skit is designed to be funny, but there's also some realism there because you do go through the, those things in your mind pop up. You're like, what time of year is that? What's, what's going on that time of year? <laughs> What is happening? Because I kind of, I pretty much missed this uh, hunting season with having Willis and um, still was able to go do hunts and stuff, but I know that um, September is going to be pretty much off limits for me. Pretty much. I could still go on a hunt or two in October though, right? Yeah, October's fine. Yeah. See, you heard it. You just folks. have to have your yeah. baby bag packed for the hospital. Okay. All right. Well, I, this is all new for me, y'all. <laughs> Which is the best part because you guys will be coming along. That is right. So if you want to, if if you're a lady out there and you want to, you're more into this and you want to follow along, uh, you can follow along on her vlog channel, uh, talking about the nutrition dietetics behind uh, pregnancy and, and going along and doing all that. Yeah. You're pretty much just gonna see funny stuff on my channel. <laughs> but I'm really excited now that we've like told you guys because I've been wanting to talk about it on my vlog so much. Because yeah. I've been just not feeling the best. Things have been going crazy. Like we literally, <laughs> we're moving right now. We we are literally like probably weeks away from selling our home. Um, and we don't have a house. We're sitting at my parents' house right now. We're probably going to be moving in with my, my parents. And we're pregnant. Although all this stuff is going on, we're super pumped and excited. So the skit was designed to be funny, but... We, we had been trying for a while, but actually before I got the brain tumor and, and nothing was happening and then I got the brain tumor and 
obviously there was nothing going on then. <laughs> um, after taking care of all that, um, we started we started trying again, and finally we have conceived a little fishing freak in the belly. And I'm sure we're gonna have to do one of these gender reveal videos. I'm sure we will. We're gonna have to come up with something really cool for that fishing or hunting wise or something. I That'll think we cool. should know soon. Like how soon? weeks really I assume so like how, how do you know how do you find out that soon I mean right now just to give everyone a little the last time I saw it it was like that big if he did baby fish and freak like that big it was it's like, like a, a little minnow <laughs> and now it's like a, a raspberry about half an inch a raspberry see how our comparisons <laughs> I'm a minnow she's a fruit that's mm. that's our channels so what do they do they go back in there with a the sonogram unit a little Lawrence. Yes, yeah, so I don't see my next appointment it. isn't until a couple weeks from now, and I think that will be the time where they'll be like, "Hey, you want to do a DNA test?" And I know you can do a gender questioning. Or it just seems so early. I know it does. I don't know. We're, we're new to this. Wow. We're new to this. <laughs> but we do know for sure there's only one in there, uh, and the heartbeat looks good and everything. Uh, we're just praying, and we hope you are too. That it's just a, a happy, healthy baby. Um, don't care on the gender right now, although I would like to have a little boy fishing for you. Just, like, just go throw that out there. <laughs> throw that out there. I'd love to have a little girl. I'm just throwing that one out there. <laughs> <laughs> but we're, we're excited just, just to have a baby and we've been trying for a while. And with uh, Winston being out of the picture, um, not having a dog, you know, um, we're just, everything's happening fast now. It's just rocking and rolling. 2018 is, is awesome. Plus, uh, we're both doing our, our channels, so there's just going to be constant, constant content, guys. So I hope you subscribe. I hope you come along for the adventure of... 2018. Yes, of this whole process. <laughs> Please understand that uh, once this, once you get, like, huge, I guess. Thanks. Will you get huge? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that's I the wrong thing not. to say. <laughs> once you get bigger... Uh, uh, videos may may change. There may be some mood swings or something like that. We'll have to. <laughs> so just hang in there. With us. We'll try to create as much as possible without interfering with the marriage and all that, <laughs> all that stuff. Uh, this is something that we've been looking forward to for a really long time. I know a lot of you have been out there saying the same thing. You know, when are you guys gonna have a baby? Gosh, it's like every other hey comment. Guys. Yeah, so this is the big news, and we're glad to drop it on you here today. I really haven't been feeling like healthy food lately, so... And yeah, yeah what's, what has your taste buds been like lately? Because you've been... I, I, am, I am along for these emotional <laughs> and mental, physical changes here. Um, maybe there's a lot of young fishing freaks out there that... Uh, are curious about this whole experience. Maybe. I feel um, like my entire like taste palette has changed now. Like I'm going back. Like okay, my normal stuffy food routine. Yeah. I don't feel like eating any of that. Greens sound terrible to me. Avocados. I don't want anything to do with them. Wow. So you just feel like crushing carbs and meats. Like all I want is Mexican food, and that's I so not like that. me. I can like, get I down. Like I never crave Mexican food. I can. Yeah, I can tell you. The whole time we've been together, I don't think we've ever been. To, to a Mexican, a Mexican food, food restaurant mm -hmm. and uh, 2018 probably gonna be enjoying some good Tex-Mex and breakfast burritos that's like a dream bring thing. it on baby <laughs> breakfast, breakfast burritos, burritos. Uh, breakfast tacos and breakfast burritos are my favorite on the water breakfast food throw it in there with a hot cup of coffee like a free range <laughs> and you are in business to go enjoy your day you guys gotta see one of the cutest things in the whole entire world Steph got me it is just a bundle of cuteness. Look at this right here. Oh my gosh, when it came in the mail. Look at this right here. Diet of cuteness. <laughs> Look at that baby fishing freak. <laughs> that is just, this This kind of like, this hits me right here. I feel you like know, it's Just like... to see like the size. <laughs> it's it's as like, big as your thigh. Oh man, <laughs> this is what's happening right now. Little baby fishing freak. <laughs> I th this also, Made me think if you guys want like some some smaller sizes and fishing freak gear, I really haven't done much fishing freak apparel. Um, but if you guys want to want to see, like, maybe you have youngsters out there want to see like some really small stuff. I'm not saying onesies. I mean that's a little that's pushing it a little too far. <laughs> but if you want to see like like more kid Taller. size and stuff or um, some different fishing freak designs, let me know in the comments below because this just got me inspired. 
to like, you know, get the young kids into so fishing cute. right away. Right away. Get them in there right away. And that is going to wrap right. today's video, y'all. I hope you enjoyed the skit. Make sure to smash the thumbs up, like button for all that. That always takes extra effort. Ocean Spoon Girl did an excellent job filming on this one as well. She's getting really handy with the camera, doing her own vlogs. And uh, we had a lot of fun filming this together. So I think you'll see some more skits throughout the year on this channel. Uh, Especially as like we progress. I feel like there's going to be some funny moments. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can just guarantee you there's going to be moments where uh, it's going to be funny. We're probably going <laughs> to have some good creative skits come off of it. So stay tuned for those. And I still have full permission to go bass fishing, right? You do, just not in September. Okay. Absolutely, you get out there. There you go. And there's probably going to be moments where I want to go fishing pretty <laughs> bad. You know what I'm saying? Let's just hope I'm not going to be moody. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, y'all. We love each and every one of you. We thank you for your support. Uh, if you want to go check out the merch channel and help support this channel, because we might be needing some buy uh, some diapers and all that kind of stuff this time of year. You want to close this one out? I mean, this is this. You are charity. The next <laughs> the generation. Future. The future yes. of fishing freak. Yes. Nation. Exactly. Expanding the fishing freak army. Man, that puts a lot of pressure on me. Yeah. Maybe I should go out fishing more with you while I'm pregnant. You should. Absolutely. Absolutely. You get them started early. Fish is good for pregnant women too, right? Fish? Yeah. yeah. Just not the big fish. Okay. All right. Well, more, more yeah. of that. Sure. More of that knowledge on her channel. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching, and uh, I guess we'll see you guys in the next video. Catch you on the next one. Say that one. We'll catch you on the next one. Yeah, 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 say it like that. <laughs> and we'll catch you on the next one. All right. Baby aboard! <laughs>